All right, all right, all right. This is the Pantera special. Check it out. No, it's not true. We wrote the songs in the studio. Yeah, we wrote the songs in the studio and recorded them as we went. As we went. We but did write them first and then go in the studio. They're, they're very spontaneous and they got the original vibe that was going on when we created the song. It just happened. We don't plan anything uh, except to kick ass. <laughs> that's it. There's a lot about what we were, I mean, we drove each other to new levels, man. Right. The drums, they, you know, they made me do stuff I didn't think I could do, you know. Each, each individual did the same stuff, you know. In, in, in a different direction, to better Pantera. You know, each one of us individually, well, speaking for those three, they could all play anything you pretty much put in front of them. But as far as Pantera music goes, you know, we, we feel like we've done the best album that we could at the time. Next week, we'll do a better one, but this is what we did this time, and we, we're real happy with it. Real happy with it. Yeah, well, everything changes a little bit. Every, every day is a different day, so things yeah. do change, and it's evolution, but I mean, as people, I don't think any of us have changed, you know? Well, if we change, then it's just, you know, within ourselves, nothing to do with Pantera. Right, with right. Pantera, I think we're all pretty focused on what we have to do.
this year and, and the next year with this particular album, and that's Destroy. Anyway, I guess you can check on the song. Let's show Rock and Roll. Basic heavy metal, probably just yeah. early metal. You know, the that's that's stuff. I mean, old Black Sabbath, the big in Judas Priest, Judas all Priest. that stuff. You know, I mean, we're not embarrassed to admit it, like most bands who hide their Judas Priest albums and hide their Metallica albums and hide Iron their Slayer Man. albums and they tie funny clothes on and they put funny lights on and call themselves alternative and they're really metal bands. Right. We're not afraid of that at all. We got offered to do this uh, Black Sabbath tribute album that's coming out. And uh, we wanted to do a different sounding song. We didn't want to do Paranoid or Sweet Leaf or anything that a lot of bands have covered. So uh, we, we picked Planet Caravan, we did it. We were real happy with it, it turned out killer. It's the first thing we did. And uh, then we got dicked off of getting it on the record by Record Company Politics. It was on a different label from us, it didn't work out. So instead of putting it in the trash or putting it on the shelf, you know, we said, let's put it on our record, man. It's too good to throw away. And we put it on the album last, so it has nothing to do with our integrity of our album. It doesn't ruin the flow of our album at all. And I wrote a little note on the record on behalf of me and the band that it has nothing to do with a change in direction or anything. Our integrity is always there. It's just something that we did and we thought was very good. And we put it out for people to hear. They can listen to it or they don't need to. It's up to them. very attentive they very watch everything attentive. you do they watch every little thing you do and they know That's everything cool. about you too it's yeah, really they strange. know everything they, they, they know it all but that that has to do with japanese press though also japanese press takes care of bands when they come through when they visit japan they're all over and they cover them you know a 20 page 